hey guys and welcome back to my youtube channel once again my name is ronald if so you guys know the drill it's as simple as liking share subscribe of course today actually is my son's third birthday and so i'm gonna make something very soon and by that i mean a cake so i'm just gonna make something where i don't have to use any kind of icing sugar and that's very really a lot easier i'm gonna incorporate some fresh fruit in it and uh, also i'm gonna use cool whip i know something very basic well i hope you guys are ready So the trick about this cake guys what you need to know if you're using cold whip cold whip will of course um disappear a lot faster if it's under a lot of heat so if you're doing it make sure your cake is nice and cool and also put it in the fridge right away and of course make sure it's going to be used as soon as possible it's not something you're going to make and then use it the following day unless you put it in the freezer but i don't recommend that okay so we're going to get started right now guys to show you step by step So basically that was it that's what it looks like everybody loved it everybody seems to enjoy it i mean even liam or well, let's just say he never really enjoyed it i mean what are we killing whenever we make cakes for our kids they never really eat them we make cakes for ourselves i know we make them for the birthday boy or birthday girl but sometimes they can't eat them he never really 
even wanted to test it this time. Yet last time, uh, that cake that I made, he really actually enjoyed it. Well, you know, you live and learn. So you know what? Maybe some I'll try something else different next time. What am I saying here, guys? You don't necessarily have to uh, go out there, buy a cake, or which is costly or whatever. If you have the time, I highly suggest you make it. And also, this includes your kids, of course, to have fun uh, making the cake with you. Anyways, as always, of course, I also do a word of the day here. So today, the word of the day is simply going to be uh, cake. How do you say cake in my language? Honestly, it doesn't actually change that much. We just say cake. KG is a heck. We just basically change how you're pronouncing it. Alright, thanks guys. I hope to see you in my next video. And of course, check out other videos you see around. Bye now.